Angel, tell us a little bit about what's happening in Puerto Rico with the CM and the CEA. Yeah, there's there's uh, basically, due to the federal funding that we have uh, got, uh, there are some requirements that they are asking us to either go into the CEM or have already completed the CEM course through the consulting services with the government. This is one of the bases that they're asking in uh, RFI or RFPs. Um, in addition to that, uh, there was debating if PE with uh, lead AB or PE with CEM, uh, they're, they're a good combination, but most of it they're uh, leading to CEM. So you see the CEM growing in Puerto Rico then? It's kind of, and uh, some of the government uh, agencies basically they're asking their uh, individuals or engineers to go and take the training and be able to get the certification. Some of them they want to do internal uh, energy audit or okay. just going out on the consulting. Well, good, and tonight we're going to charter your chapter, so uh, we're looking forward to it.